How you doing? Stephen Griffin again, Griffin Notary Services, LLC, YouTube channel. Answers part three. Do I need an LLC? That depends on how you want to structure your business. The first thing I suggest is that you read up on what an LLC is, the benefits of an LLC, as well as the downsides of an LLC, along with understanding the positives and negatives of a sole proprietorship. Once you understand those things, then you can make the proper determination for yourself whether or not you need an LLC. Do I need a separate business bank account? Do I need a separate bank account for my business? Yes, you do. Any accountant will tell you commingling funds between personal and business is a no-no. Do I need a business license? That depends on your state or I mean your city or county rules and regulations. Some cities and counties may not require it, others may. In addition, you need to find out whether or not the banks that you get in your business bank account in, whether they require you to have a business license. Do I need an EIN? Yes, you will need an EIN for either your sole proprietor or your LLC. Whichever one you plan on doing, you will need an EIN. Should I rent a car? That depends on your financial situation and your vehicle situation. If you don't have a reliable vehicle and you can afford to rent a car on a weekly or monthly basis, then you will make a determination of whether or not you can do that. If you're not planning on working the notary business to a point where you can have the money to pay for that rental car, you're only being very selective in the orders that you take, then you may not have the funds to rent that car. But whether you should or should not rent a car for your business is a decision that you have to make based on you knowing what your financial situation is and the real, and the status of the current car you have and the goings and comings of your family to support whether or not you need to have an additional car. Should I do general notary work? In short, general notary work is work that we that we identify as non mortgage related. The answer is it is up to you whether or not you want to have an additional source of income coming into you. If all you want to do is focus on loan closings, then you're probably not going to do general notary work. If you're looking at maximizing your notary commission, then you'll probably do general notary work. But that is completely up to you based off of what your plans are, what your goals are for your notary business. That concludes part three of the answers. Thank you and have a wonderful day.